What is going on, guys? Grave here. Of course, today is Tuesday, so we got our weekly uh, Red Dead Online update. This week's update brings a few new things to the game. I will link the newswire down in the description if you'd like to read over it for yourself. This week, you're going to search Annisburg for the Ember of the East. This is going to be a new uh, opportunity mission for the Blood Money update. Of course, we only had one available in game before today, so now we'll have two opportunity missions that we can do. Uh, also, it says during this week, if you find the ember and successfully place it in the hands of your employer by August the 2nd, you can earn a, a reward of a free offhand holster. Also, completing this uh, opportunity on Ruthless will unlock the Annisburg cap for the uh, for purchase from Madame Nazar. Also, this week we got a new crime uh, kind of contract as well called the Dockside contract. This is going to be a you know a crime that you can go just get from your normal blood money uh, contacts. And it will be kind of working uh, against a local shipping business in San Denis. It says just be ready to get your hands dirty. Also, they go on to talk about the Quick Draw Club number one. Just reminding everyone, if you buy all four Quick Draw Club passes, you will get Halloween Pass 2 for free. Also, this week, waived uh, camp setup fees. So you can move your camp as much as you want. There will be no fees for it. Uh, also, aspiring traders can take five gold bars off the cost of the butcher table. Dressing up and looking sharp is also more affordable this week as tailors are offering 40% off all standard non-roll outfits, while gunsmiths are also offering 30% off all repeaters. Also this week, you have improved saddles and saddlebags are 30% off. The bounty wagon is 30% off. Uh, the varmint rifle is 30% off. The navy revolver is 30% off. Camp dogs are 40% off. Camp themes are 40% off. Uh, clothing, trinkets, and cr equipment at Gus's store is 40% off, and ponchos are also 40% off. That's it for this week, guys. Of course, like I said, not a big, big update, but at least we did get a new opportunity and a new crime mission to do. So hopefully that will kind of help a few people out when it comes to just kind of getting bored of doing the same blood money crimes and the blood money opportunity over and over. Uh, hopefully in the future we'll get some more of these added in we do know there's going to be three in total i'm hoping they're going to do more of these down the road i wish they would have released them all at once that way we had more things to do i know a lot of people don't like doing the same missions just kind of over and over like the stranger missions you did in the past a lot of people feel it's a bit repetitive but anyway guys leave me a comment with your thoughts and of course if you like the video hit the like if you haven't subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace